Hey there guys, Chet here. Today I'm going to compare Microsoft Planner and Planner Premium, two task and project management solutions within the Microsoft 365 environment. I'll compare their features, pricing, user experience, integrations, customer support, and more. So by the end of this video, you'll have a clear idea of which platform is the right choice for you. First off, let's talk about what each version is designed for. Microsoft Planner is a basic user-friendly task management tool that comes bundled with Microsoft 365. It's ideal for small teams or departments that need a simple way to assign tasks, set deadlines, and track progress using boards and charts. It's highly visual and integrates well with Microsoft Teams, making it a great entry point for collaborative work. On the other hand, Planner Premium, also known as the Project Plans, is made for more advanced project management. These plans expand the capabilities of Planner with deeper planning, tracking, and reporting features that go well beyond basic task lists. Now let's talk about the features. The basic planner is simple and easy to use. It gives you task boards, buckets, checklists, attachments, and a dashboard to track progress. It works well for small projects or organizing team tasks, but if you're looking for more control, Planner Premium takes things to the next level. With Plan 1, you get tools for goals, sprints, advanced templates, and timeline views to stay on track. Plan 3 adds even more, like Microsoft 365 Copilot task history, baselines, roadmaps, project finances, and access to project online. And if you really need professional tools, Plan 5 has advanced portfolio management and enterprise resource allocation. In short, the basic planner is great for staying organized, while Planner Premium is ideal for managing big, complex projects like a professional. Next, let's talk about user experience. Microsoft Planner is simple and easy to use. If you have a Microsoft 365 account, you can jump right in without a whole lot of effort. It works well on both desktop and mobile, and the way it connects with Teams makes everyday communication very smooth. Meanwhile, Planner Premium is a bit more complex. The higher tiers like Plan 3 and Plan 5 feel more like traditional project management tools. They come with features like Gantt charts, task dependencies, and budget tracking. If you already know project management, you will enjoy the details, but if it's new to you, it might take a little getting used to to get the hang of it. Both tools integrate well within the Microsoft ecosystem. They work with Teams, Outlook, SharePoint, and OneDrive, and Planner Premium adds deeper integration with Power BI, Project Online, and more automation through Power Platform. Now let's talk about pricing. Microsoft Planner is included for free in most Microsoft 365 plans. If you need advanced features, Planner Plan 1 is priced at $10 per user per month. Planner and Project Plan 3 cost $30 per user per month, and Plan 5 comes in at $55 per user per month, all billed annually. So, the big question, which one should you choose? If your team needs something lightweight and easy to use for day-to-day -day collaboration, the standard Microsoft Planner is probably all that you'll need. But if you're managing complex timelines, budgets, or large cross-functional teams, Planner Premium is definitely worth the investment. All right, that's it for this video. If you found it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.